Hey, take three. <laughs> we're gonna do things a little bit differently today. Uh, we're visiting an incubator of a company called uh, Devasoft. Basically what they've done for me is they've laser cut and bent sheet metal to create a finished piece of the product and it's a fan bracket for the router. This is, I think, the third or the fourth uh, video in this series, so make sure you check the other videos out. I'll leave the links down below and yeah, let's go. The company Devensoft is a Slovenian high added value company. They're one of those stealth companies that most of you probably don't know about, but they're everywhere. Their core business is making measurement devices. But what we are more interested in is their accelerator or incubator for hardware companies or hardware startups called Catapult, which translates to a catapult. So they basically propel your business idea into the sky, so to speak. What kind of services does an incubator like Catapult offer? Consulting, design, welding, 3D printing, CNC, laser cutting, metal sheet bending, pretty much anything you want, they can make it. But what is best in all of this is it's almost a same day delivery thing because they do want to help small companies around to flourish, they will provide them with pretty much any product if it's feasible from at a prototyping stage of course but what's even better in the long run if the companies they help succeed they even have the capacity to build production lines because I as a company owner I don't have the time to also be at the assembly line for example so they also provide us with assembly lines and they provide shipping services all of it for either for free or for really cheap because they want to make sure that the companies like mine succeed. I do have a couple of other plans with them in the long run, but unfortunately I can't talk about them yet. Uh, but make sure if they pan out, you're subscribed because you will learn first on this channel. We're now in front of Catapult which is the incubator that I have my bracket uh, being made in. Keep in mind that most of the machines you're about to see are high-tech, meaning computer-driven and optimized. Let's go check it out. Access granted. So this is the fan bracket that will be mounted into the router and it's done in two steps. First, it's being cut on a laser machine, uh, which I can show you, but it's not working today because it's being serviced or worked on. However, if you would like to see it in action, let me know in the comments below and we'll shoot another video just for this. And the second step, the sheet metal that the laser machine cuts is being bent on a special sheet metal bending machine. The one thing I forgot, which is why this prototyping phase is for, is I forgot to um, accommodate for bigger fans. So I've chosen the narrow ones and I forgot the bigger or the fatter or thicker ones also exist. Uh, so this particular bracket only mounts this one, but not the thick one. So we'll come back in another episode, most likely, in which we will show you how the laser works and also we will make the kind of more final or the next version of bracket prototype. First, if you're enjoying the video, please click like because it helps me out a ton with the YouTube uh, algorithm. And second, I've left an uh, interest check form in the description of the video down below. 
which you can visit and fill it out if this router is something you'd be interested in purchasing once it's complete. I'm asking this because I've gotten a lot of private messages of people asking me when or where they can buy it. Well, you can't yet, but if you leave a comment in my interest check form below or in this video, I'll know I'm doing the right thing and going in the right direction. So any kind of support is appreciated. Thank you. This is how a mounted bracket looks like. Uh, as I said earlier, it's not quite done yet. In fact, this is the first prototype, so we found a bit, <laughs> we found a couple of bugs, let's call it, uh, which the team here will work on now to fix it. And in the next episode, we should have it ready. <laughs> much it when it comes to production of fan brackets uh, as you saw it's pretty straightforward first you take a piece of sheet metal you laser cut it and finally you bend it on sheet metal bending machine <laughs> if you found any value in this video please consider subscribing and before you go don't forget to click that like button and yeah I'll see you in the next one